Hello, welcome to this video for the Ford Focus 1.6 16 valve petrol ZTEC Climate. This is the five door hatchback 2007. I think it's registered the 31st of March 2007. Uh, it's covered 98,000 miles. It's got full service history and only two former keepers. The first keeper was believed to be the Ford dealer. Uh, so we've got two private owners, full service history. As you can see, it's in gleaming black metallic. It's called Panther Black Metallic, this colour. It's in really good condition. Let's start off with this corner. As you can see, in really good condition. Alloy wheels are nice and clean. Uh, we've got a couple of new tyres on this vehicle as well, which is really good. The bonnet's in good condition. There's no cracks on the windscreen or chips. It is the heated element front screen as well. So if you look very closely, you can see little wires in there. There's a heated wires, so it's heated front windscreen. So we've got the wing mirrors there, very clean. No scuffs on the edges at all. That door, very clean, as you can see. Uh, and the previous owner has looked after this vehicle very well. It's also been deconned, meaning that usually down here you get a few spots of um, tar, etc. All that's been removed uh, with the clay bar and it's all been polished and that. So that's the alloy wheel there. Even the brake drums there are nice and black, not rusty. The tyre there, that's a new tyre, as you can see. Corner of that bumper, very good condition. No signs of any damage at all. New number plates as well. As you can see, a set of new number plates have been fitted to this vehicle. Very, very slight mark there. A little tiny one on the corner. That is it. So very good condition. That tyre's quite good as well. As you can see. That mirror, windscreen, nothing on there at all. Very clean, that bonnet as well. This bumper corner, that's nice and clean now as well. The headlights are nice and clear. And the chrome's nice as well, so chrome works all there. Okay, and the roof, so it's not got the roof there. The roof's good, there's nothing on the roof at all. And the rear spoiler there as well. That's all good. Let's start in the bike then. So, open the bike. We've got the parcel shelf there. We've got the clips there as well. Nice clean boot. If we lift up the carpet, we've also got uh, a spare wheel as well. A slimline spare wheel. It's all nice and clean. And the toolkit is under there as well. So the toolkit is under there. It's all there. And uh, we've got the locking wheel bolt as well, or the locking wheel nut, should we say? Got little grab handles there for the boot. All this is nice and clean. And that's all nice and clean, so no scuffs on the plastic there. The rubber trim as well there, nice. And that rubber trim there, no scuffs or scratches on there. So that's very good. Close that. It's got the rear wash wipe as well. Heated rear screen, of course. The rubber for the wiper is nice and good. It's not falling to bits. Inside the fuel cap there, uh, unleaded as you can see all nice and clean and unbelievably it's still got the the rubber attachment there which usually snaps and breaks so you can tell that the previous owner has been very gentle not vigorous with that okay let's have a look at the back doors open the back doors and all nice and clean no trap seat belt marks there at all all the floors clean there's a storage bin there as well all backs the seats are clean the side airbags there and they're up there as well, airbags as well, so a very safe car, of course, the back seats are very clean, free headrest, free seat belts as well, split fold as well, uh, and as you can see, immaculate condition, so it's like a blue inner, slightly blue inners, and the grey outers, so that's the interior, let's go to the other side, check out that door card, this door card, all nice and clean, no trap seat belt marks there, that door card, no damage, nothing out of the ordinary at all. 
all these little pockets are nice and clean. There's nothing there. It doesn't smell of dogs and it doesn't smell of smoke either. So that's a good sign. This door here, that's nice and clean. Nothing out of the ordinary. All the door shuts are clean as well. No wear and tear on the rubber there. No trap seat belt marks. All oh, that's nice and clean down there. Carpet, well, we've got some car mats ordered for this actually, so it will have some new car mats. That seat's nice. There's no wear and tear on that. There's no cigarette burns. And the engine's nice and quiet as well, as you can hear. This door here, very clean. Oh, this is the locking wheel nut. So the locking wheel nut is in here. The bolt is in here. Little locking wheel nut key. So that's in there, so we don't lose it. Electric front windows, electric mirrors as well. Down here, very clean door shuts. All the foot pedals are nice and clean. It's got the driver's seat height adjustment lever there, so that it goes up and down. All the rubbers are nice and clean. There's no scratches on that plastic there at all. And there's no wear and tear on that rubber trim, that soft rubber trim. Uh, and there's no trap seat belt marks there at all as well. The seat in immaculate condition. There's no wear and tear on that. Let's get inside the car. So let's get inside the car. Let's look what we've got in here. Close the door, that's better. So 98,780 miles, there we go. No warning lights on. In fact, let me just prove that. So switch the engine off, turn the key again. All the lights come on, as you can see. Battery light, engine light, they're all there. Start that, and they all go off. Okay, so there's no, no warning on this vehicle at all. It's got this uh, Ford CD600 uh, stereo as well here. So air conditioning, uh, the heated front screen button there, heated rear screen, the 12 volt there, a little bit of a coin tray down here, the five speed gear lever, totally uh, in mint condition, no wear and tear at all. A little pen holder, drinks holder there, the armrest as well here, it's a nice leather armrest, leather uh, handbrake gaiter there and leather uh, handbrake lever as well. Also got the uh, Steering column uh, stalk uh, volume controls. That's what that's the name for it. <laughs> and then a menu there on that for the uh, fuel computer as well. Uh, intermittent wash wipe uh, the stalk there, and there's your lights there as well. Your lights and your height adjustment for the uh, lights. Three keys. So we've got two remote control ones. Actually, one needs a battery. I'm going to change that. So one does work on the remote. One doesn't. I think it needs a new battery. I'm going to change that. And one there, which is a manual one. So we've got three keys in total. So a very rare occurrence. Three keys. The dashboard is nice and clean. As you can see, no glue marks where someone's stuck with a sat nav, etc. We've got these lovely tweeters up here. So the stereo system actually sounds quite good. I'm just going to turn it up a little bit. This is the Sky VIP. That's good. So we've got that. It's a nice stereo system. We've got the glove box. We've got the uh, service history as well. I'm going to show you the service history as well. We've got the V5. We've got the... Uh, Yes, we've got locking, we've got everything, everything. We've got the MOT certificate. We've got the lot for this one. Uh, a nice clean glove box there. Uh, it's got the drinks holder there as well. Uh, what else have we got? So let's get this, get this booklet out. So the booklet here. So we've got the V5, we've got some invoices here as well. Uh, servicing invoices. So it's been done. Um, oil filter, air filter, etc. Mileage. A uh, place there called Auto Fix in Sheffield. Uh, two front wish bones supplied, £160. Uh, what's this? Check and clean front and rear brake disc and pads as well. So it's been looked after good. Um, and then we've got the service stamps here. So we've got all these service stamps here uh, as well. So two, four, six, eight, nine. So we've just serviced it as well. So it's got nine service stamps. So we just had fresh oil in that one. Uh, and then we've got the reg, we've got that. We've also got the key code as well. So if you ever lose uh, the uh, stereo code, it's all there. 
as well so everything is with the vehicle okay right under the bonnet so let's go under the bonnet now to open the bonnet on these this year ford focus you have to open it with the key so the key is here so you have to flip this bag open there right so stick your key in there turn once the left to pop it and then you turn that way and then you lift the bonnet which i'm going to try and do now oh hang on oh, i might have to put the phone down oh, wait a minute if i do that no i'm going to put the phone down one second put the phone down okay i've done it i've done it so let's put the uh, bonnet stay in there we go okay so there we have it open as you can see in here it's lovely condition just being valeted by our man john done a cracking job as you can see nice red antifreeze there power steering fluids up to the level as well the screen wash has been topped up as well all the covers are there the, even the battery cover which is very rare because over the years people just throw them out or leave them and get broken it's there so battery covers there everything's nice and tidy it's HBI clear so it's never been involved or it's never had an insurance claim against it for any damage the vehicle as you can see all the nuts and bolts are there all these little clips they're all there so nothing's missing nothing suspect at all so we've got a very good clean straight car here even the bonnet all nice and clean there's nothing so very very tidy very impressive okay drop that again so you have to take the key out of here and flick the badge over there and that's that okay so just walk around the vehicle once more and we're done oh the brake disc are very new as well if you look at this, there's no lips on them brake disc at all it's a very good old brake disc in fact there's a receipt in there for the brake disc as well so brake disc a couple of tires have been renewed you can tell with the condition of the vehicle this has been looked after it is a proper car as they say in yorkshire okay so if you've got a part exchange please let us know we do accept part exchanges uh finance it may be a little bit too old for finance this one uh so we can't help you there but you know it's not a great deal of money uh, but you know it is to someone who's looking who's only got that budget so yeah but it's a good car so hope you enjoyed the video and uh, hope to see you soon. Thank you.